Working across cultures three, track thirty five. Call one. It's the first time we have heard about this, and my view is that we should find out more about what the markets think. Because, no, I think this and is then because it of will, the way that. And then I'm sure that I the, think that. Working across cultures three, track thirty six, call two. It's the right time to think about the new marketing strategy for all the new ranges across all the markets, except for the Latin American region, where I think we should adopt a different approach. Working across cultures three, track thirty-seven, call three. Well, I, I don't think it will work here, but I like the idea in general. Sorry, I don't know who said that. Where are you? Yes, sorry. This is Carlos in Australia. Working across cultures three, track thirty-eight, call four. Yes, about the marketing strategy. Well, this reminds me of the time when I was playing golf with Mr. Takagi, and he told me about the best way to hit the ball. There's an old Japanese proverb, which is a very good way of remembering the importance. Working across cultures three, track thirty-nine. Call five. Yes. Hello. Is there anybody there? I'm a bit late. Sorry.、Uh, how, how does this microphone work again? Let's see.、Uh, if I do this, then maybe. Working across cultures three, track forty. Call six. What do you think? Well, my suggestion is to look at the finance again to try and save、uh, as much as we can on the ad for the. Working across cultures three, track thirty-five, call one. It's the first time we have heard about this, and my view is that we should find out more about what the markets think. Because, no, I think this is because of will, the way that. And then I'm sure that I the, think that. Working across cultures three, track thirty six, call two. It's the right time to think about the new marketing strategy for all the new ranges across all the markets, except for the Latin American region, where I think we should adopt a different approach. Working across cultures three, track thirty seven. Call three. Well, I, I don't think it will work here, but I like the idea in general. Sorry, I don't know who said that. Where are you? Yes, sorry. This is Carlos in Australia. Working across cultures three, track thirty-eight. Call four. Yes, about the marketing strategy. Well, this reminds me of the time when I was playing golf with Mr. Takagi, and he told me about the best way to hit the ball. There's an old Japanese proverb, which is a very good way of remembering the importance. Working across cultures three, track thirty-nine, call five. Yes. Hello. Is there anybody there? I'm a bit late. Sorry.、Uh, how, how does this microphone work again? Let's see.、Uh, if I do this, then maybe. Working across cultures three, track forty, call six. Martin, what do you think? Well. My suggestion is to look at the finance again to try and save、uh, as much as we can on the ad for the. Working across cultures three, track forty-one. I do not. Well, this is interesting. Anyway.、Uh, Hello, everyone. <laughs> right in this afternoon's session of the cultural training course, and before you go to your breakout groups, I'd like to talk a bit about international conference calls. These are becoming more and more common and cheaper now that the web is being used for phone calls. 
Firstly, I'd like to look at the most common problems and then move on to a few tips and pieces of advice. I suppose many things are common sense. However, it can all take some getting used to. The first thing to say is about technology. This is probably the most common problem I hear about. There are a lot of different systems and, as with all technology, it sometimes goes wrong. Systems can crash and people get cut off. So be prepared for that, as it can be very frustrating. Also, there are times when there are people taking part in a conference call who are not familiar with the technology and who don't know how the equipment works. This is a training issue. The other thing is, background noise can be a big problem, especially if a mobile or cell phone is used as these tend to pick up a lot of background noise. Finally, there may be problems with people not being sensitive and speaking very fast, maybe because of nerves or just because they behave differently on the phone. Working Across Cultures 3, Track 42. And now I'd like to look at a few solutions to the problems and offer some tips for both participants and call leaders. It may seem obvious, but when you are part of a conference call, make sure you are in a quiet place and not likely to be interrupted or disturbed. This follows on from what I said earlier. Actually, the mute button is important to use when you are not speaking so that you can reduce background noise. Personally, I use a headset for this type of call. Also, try and avoid eating, drinking, or chewing gum while on a conference call, as this can be noisy for others. If you really need to have a drink, remember to use the mute button. Moving on to participants, a few quick pieces of advice. Prepare for the call in advance. Think about and plan what you may need to say and perhaps any questions you may have. Have any documents you may need close to hand so that you don't need to look for them during the call. Being on time is also important. When speaking, if it's not clear from the technology being used, it can be helpful to say who you are each time you speak. For example, This is Mike. I didn't catch the name of the marketing firm. Could you say it again, please? As in face-to-face -face meetings, when you speak, Stay on topic. Short contributions will be more memorable, and a conference call is not really the place for long speeches. Another good tip is to signal or label what you say. For example, this is Mike, and my idea is... The other thing to say is, try not to interrupt people when they are speaking. Listen carefully, and wait to be invited to comment by the call leader. Avoid taking notes on a computer, as typing will be noisy for the other participants. A pen and paper, although old-fashioned, is still effective. 